welcome to another tutorial of how to steam your wig. In this case, we are using our specimen, which is Avalon by Aesthetica Designs in the color Icy Shadow. After putting in my hot electric rollers, which are flocked and not too hot for the Aesthetica Designs regular synthetic fiber, I left them in for two, I repeat, two evenings, and now I'm disengaging the rollers. And it looks like those curls are quite bouncy and frizz free. Look at that movement. And using end papers, jumbo size. Very important. I decided to address a little bit of face flap that I detected might be an issue. So I took a flexible rod and simply rolled up the front section very carefully and secured it with a pin. using a John Renault steamer, which is my fourth one because unfortunately they tend to leak from the bottom, I was able to effectuate an off the face flapping issue. Here are my flocked rollers. They're fantastic. De Regaire, a must have. And look at that frizz-free nape. It is looking fabulous. Very satisfied with the outcome. I grabbed my thinning shears just to touch up the ends a bit. With the teeth up. And there you have it. She's all set to go. Alrighty, so this is the end result of the project. Now, although she doesn't have the same curl pattern, she looks pretty good though. And here's her from all sides.
So I did want to get the um, Beachy Wave in there, but that could not be done, unfortunately. So yeah, that's a little better, kind of, yeah. So I'm using this stuff, which is okay. The only thing with this thing is you have to kind of hold it with a um, rat tail comb for a moment. Otherwise, it doesn't like really work out. So I wanted it to, yeah, there we go. If I hold it like this for two minutes, this will work. So don't let it go for two minutes. 